Hello and welcome to a special Sunday edition of Justice. I'm Judge Jeanine Pirro. Thanks for being with us tonight. You are watching now an incredible display of unity among world leaders, reminiscent, if you're old enough to remember, of the liberation of Paris from Nazi Germany in 1944. Today, Europe stared down terror in a peaceful demonstration, a solidarity march where millions protested the Paris attacks by the Islamic extremists. Sunday's march will most certainly make history. And they march, certainly shoulder to shoulder, arm in arm, Jews and Arabs and Christians and Muslims, kings and queens, presidents and prime ministers, to pay tribute to the victims of the Islamic militant attacks that killed 17 innocent journalists, police and hostages. 3.7 million took part in this biggest public demonstration in the history of France. The marches were peaceful, respectful, many silent, some singing the French national anthem. And there were those there to show support for their ally and their gratitude for previous French intervention on their country's behalf. Others to simply decry the senseless violence of Islamic terrorism. And as of this date, the largest display of global unity against radical Islamic terrorism that the world has ever seen.